Welcome to Moto Compano. Let's talk about how to deal with your content, aka data management. While on tour with Moto Compano, you can record tracks, set POI, take pictures, and so on. You discover routes and folders from the community or friends send you the files of their adventures. Let's get a brief introduction on how to manage that content. Content on your device is stored in your local database to ensure you are able to use the app offline. To share files with the community and make them accessible in your web account, you need to upload them to your online database. Let's start with the tracks as those are recorded while on the road and needed to be uploaded. For example, to create a video track. Content only stored on your device is indicated by the red cloud symbol. Tap on it to upload the file and make it visible to the Motocompano community. You can restrict the visibility of your content if you are a Pro Plus user. Now the cloud is gone and you are safe to remove this file from your device if you like. To do so, swipe right on the list item to reveal more functions. You can share the content, for example as a post in your timeline, or by sending the link via email, messenger or social media to people who don't use Motocompano yet. Next to it, you find the icon to delete the file from your device. As the content is stored in your online database, you can import it again from there. With the switch, you can toggle whether this track should be shown on maps or not. This one turns grey when switched on. This means that the general visibility of tracks on maps is disabled. You can change this in settings. Other than for tracks, the visibility on maps is switched on by default for POI. That's why the switch is shown in green. Most POI here have the default names containing date and time of creation. To see what it is about, open the file by a tab on it. Ah, that's great! The current name is shown in the top bar and a tab opens the naming dialog. That's true, anywhere in the app you see a file name in the top bar. Once you have a lot of content stored on your device, the sorting options come in handy. You can sort each list by name or date and reverse the order. Or use search to find content. If you prefer a visual representation of your content, you can switch from the list to tiles. Let's see this for roots. You can share content from tile view too, but the other hidden functions are only accessible in list view. Do you remember to swipe right to reveal more functions? Remove and share are familiar, but both roots and POI have a third option. You can create a new route with a POI as first waypoint if you tap on this icon of a POI. For routes, you start navigation directly. Guess we covered all the basics for managing your content in the app. See the other videos for more details on how to create, use and share those files. But now, let's go! Take care when on the road and have fun while you intensify your modo life with Moto Compano.